and I was focusing the energy of the violet flame as well as the divine presence um, of, of God uh, and focusing that on a close family member who suffers um, a serious mental illness. Um, so he wasn't feeling well. As a matter of fact, he has fallen into such a deep state of depression and anxiety that he was experiencing not only mental pain, but also physical pain, unable to get out of bed and swirling in self-pity and anger, having even dangerous thoughts towards others and himself. So as I have been studying with Peter, the, the teachings handed down from our beloved Ascended Master, Saint Germain, how to work with the divine energy and the violet flame. So I have gone first through observing my own breath focused in my heart center into the light and visualize the ball of light uh, in, my, in my heart center and then transformed my body into the crystal body as we do in meditation here with Peter. Uh, and the light was shining outward. Then I elevated myself straight to my higher consciousness where I was able to use the I am presence I have raised my hands with palms facing forward and visualized my relative, let's call him Joseph, for example, and have spoken out loud these words. I said, I am the divine presence of God in action, healing Joseph. I am the pure God's consciousness, bringing an absolute state of health, balance and peace into Joseph's mind, body and soul. He is now feeling relieved free of suffering, which is being replaced by joy, divine love, and ultimate harmony. Thy shall be done now. And I visualized him cocooned in the divine light, shining from my hands and my heart center straight to him, wrapping him and shining through him to the point that he looked almost translucent, how bright that light was I created in my, in my spirit, in my heart and my mind by through visualization, using these exact words. And I have visualized him feeling relieved, light and happy with a big smile on his face and peace in his <clears throat> eye. Then I have evoked the violet flame and spoken the affirmations and did the visualizations with holding my hands up the same way, only he was surrounded by the violet light and I called <clears throat> on the violet Tara while um, the violet flame has purified his body, mind, and soul. The next day I have called him and I asked him, how was he feeling? I didn't tell him what I was doing, nor that I did that. And his exact words were, oh, wow, what did you do with me? I suddenly feel such a relief. All of the pain of my body and mind has gone. Wow. So then I explained what I did and what happened. And so that would be my personal testimony of how powerful this teachings, this stuff, this, this stuff really is. So now I recommend approaching this with first truly acknowledging the suffering of the other person or our, our own, and then approaching it with deeply loving and caring and motherly attitude, but with a full trust in the divine healing energy and feeling of success, of course. <clears throat> 